Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name's Sabrina and today we're starting a new series called Witchwood. Alright, let's start a new game. I haven't even opened it, I don't know. Normally like I play a little bit of it before. I honestly don't know. Once upon a and uh, once upon a time there lived an odd little witch in an odd little house. She spent most of her days tending to her odd little garden and resting her odd in her odd little chair. On this day, however, her sleep was interrupted by an odd little noise. Bah. Who's there? Get up. Use A to interact. You devil, how dare you wake a young lady from her beauty sleep? Blah. Shoo shoo. Get out of my house, you ma you're my you mindless beast. You're making a mess. A swift kick in the rump. Boot the goat through the front door. This place is so cluttered. I could have sworn I, I swept the hearth just yesterday. First things first. My old grimoire must be around here somewhere. First things first. Okay, old grimoire. Ah, here it is. Hmm. It's lighter than I recall. The grimoire contains your craftable recipes. You can open it at any time by pressing Y. All my recipes are missing. Demo of creature chewed up all the pages of my book. Where's my belt? I need to carry my things. Before I go confront the beast, I must have left it in the trunk. There you go. A braided... Oof, my poor back. How long was I napping for? I could do some medicine, ought to soothe this ache before I go outside. At least I still have the recipe for my mending poultice. Forest herb. Forest herb. Mushroom, mushroom. Outside. I feel like this music is a little too loud. Oh, vibration. All the way off. Audio. I think that one's pretty good. Oh, this is the outside. Okay. You stepped outside to the humid marsh and immediately stubbed your toe on twisted root. Ouch, close your eyes for a wink. And the next thing you know, the whole yard's gone to weeds. Somewhere in the distance, you can hear the braying through the dense something. Uh, where the cross-eyed billy goat go, he was put the garnish as a good use of this lawn. Okay. Bah, that's all you have to say for yourself, but ach. The goat coughed up a disgusting hairball. Ah, yes, hello, hello, can you hear me now? Apologies, it's been so long since I've used my moral vessel. Yuck, the dearth, there's dirt in this mouth. Pu -pu. You can talk? Of course I can talk. Has your mind become so filled with cobwebs you've forgotten your old friend? You wound me, madame. It's good to see you up and about. I was beginning to wonder if you'd ever waken, though I suppose time flows strangely in this place. Anyways... I come to collect an amount we agreed upon. Amount? Amount of what? Oh dear, you really don't remember. Well, we should go over the contract details again down there. The goat nods towards the ancient stone gateway looming nearby. And just how am I supposed to get through that solid rock? You're the one who sealed it last time. Take a closer look. I'm sure it'll come back to you. Okay, so X to...
Weakness. Don't underestimate me. Bleh. Don't underestimate your sense, my dear. You may be old, but you can see that there's cannot hidden weaknesses in the surface. I can see it now. I shall have runes etched into the surface of the stone, but they're too faint for me to read. Power of unveiling ought to do the trick. If you hadn't made a snack of my book, I wouldn't have to retranscribe my recipes. I shall not be held reliable for the losses or inconvenience incurred as a result of the abyssal possession. Okay. I need one more item. Let's see if I can find it. have one. So something's happened. I got knocked out. Maybe I don't have any shears with me. You smear a handful of glowing powder onto the runes of the door. The blue light eliminates the glyphs and envelop the entrance in an aura. You squint, attempting to discern the meaning of the letters, but appear to be something obscure runic alphabet. How oh, gibberish is this? Look at the carved in a frightful hen. Hmm, that's been written by Umbral Tongue. Allow me to translate. The goat steps up to the doorway and pauses. Hmm. Well, what does it say? The goat swings its shaggy head towards you. Um, towards you, a dark, matted wool obscures the creature's beady eyes. I cannot see. Unbelievable. What help are you? I didn't come here to help. I came to collect. Now, um, do something about the mop, would you? Fine. I think I have some rush sealed shears in the garden. Okay. Rusty old shears in the garden. Okay, we got some twine going on. Where are you? With much protesting and nickel ear, he shears away a clump of dirty hair from the goat's eyes. Ah, much better. Oh. Always grotesque the memories failing me as well. Watch your tongue and I'll give you a good snip too. Now can you read the runes or not? Hmm, or uh, yes. Um, the space between, she sleeps alone, the token given upon the unknown. Fires of four shall unroot the stone. Brazers burn, await the crone. Crone? Who's calling it a crone? Oh, it's tokens I'm burning. Perhaps you want to take a closer look at those brazers. dog hair feather a shiny stone and frog slime dog hair bird feather frog slime and a shiny stone i don't suppose you swallowed up any of those things while i was asleep i don't think so but feel free to sift through the creature's leavings if you want to be completely sure however there's a whole world outside this little swamp you know See the gate over there? Which one's lovely green flame? Goat mentions to the far side of your yard. I guess the brisk walk into the woods would do the squeaky joints. Some good. Too much time indoors is bad for the humor. Okay, that is where I'm heading. Thick tangled vines have overgrown the room's entrance. A sharper figure now so we'll go through. 
into the darkness, snipping through and tearing. Your shears make short work of the bremble. Awesome. This is giving me like wild at heart vibes. You cut your way through the remaining vines and suddenly step into the cold stone dais. Time seems to flow backwards, maybe forwards. A an oppressive star-filled void stretches as far as you can see, though there was no wind sound or in this void. The warm fall breeze is chirping the birds and sees your attention at the doorway. It's like just giving me like that. Kind of like... I don't know what the storyline is, but the, the art style, the movements, how you do things is kind of giving me wild at heart vibes. Um, but Bird watcher. A woman spins around on the heel so quickly she nearly hits you with her spyglass. Ah, you start on me. I can't see I'm busy scientific research. Research? We contraption. Why, a faint indigo turf forest lark. They said this native to this forest, and this forest only. Have you seen one perchance? You glance towards a bluebird perched atop the oblivious. Um, I haven't. Sorry. A shame. Well, it's never too late to open one's eyes to the natural world, as you'll discover. She points a nearby woodland creature stuffing their cheeks with seeds. Take that score, for example. Okay. You be a miss uh, making exciting new discoveries. So, wood. Okay, so I definitely need wood. A bundle of sticks. We got some meat. Always handy. A simple trap is what I need. Ah, uh, oh, geez, I don't know about that. Man on the shoulder, he nearly tumbles head first into the walls. Ah, you know, my arms fall in. I shouldn't be leaning over the edge, you wobbly stork. Interesting down there, anyways. Well, my grandpa used to tell people drop all sorts of treasures down there. I try well, but the rope's out. And it looks awfully dark and damp. I goosebumps like just thinking about the ghouls that are lurking down there in the shadows. Ghouls. Sure. Ever consider those ghoulies that might be goosebumps thinking about you lurking up here in the daylight? Er, no, not really. So I make you feel any better, actually. Maybe maybe the business of treasure hunting isn't for me after all. Here, why don't you take my travel? Okay. So we get the walls old and deep. You might be able to climb down. Toss the length and rope down into the well. Because we do need to get some frog stuff. We got a shiny stone. Catching that. I don't have a catching net. 
This is a snap trap. Clay. I need a catching net. I'm surprised I ha like it didn't just be like here's how to do a trapping net like it would normally. Maybe I don't have everything for the trapping net. It's locked. Who prefers to be left alone? Empty jar. Weakness unknown. See, I can make an empty jar now. I don't have a, well, I have the recipe for an empty jar. And for some reason, it doesn't allow me to. Okay. We're gonna head back up. I know where to find the the frogs now, though. What do I need? Dog's hair. Evening. Come check out pottery. I'm afraid the kiln's been up. Pottery by admiring the fine canine over there. Your point is straggly, looking mutt patrolling the yard. May I give her a petting? Oh, you can try, but I wouldn't value. I wouldn't if you value your finger. She's a touch bitey today. Ooh. Shears and Sporfic. I need. Hmm. Okay, so in order to do this, I need to find more like different mushrooms. I don't have a hatchet. Don't have a hatchet there. Oh, we have another one over here. Yoink. Hello. Ugly, great stinking pot over your head. I wouldn't ask about somebody who's stinking frog in their trousers. Oh, yeah. You jealous. The boy fumbles between the raggling of all of his frogs and sweeping ineffectual at the wayward fireflies with a shoddy looking bug net. Uh, juggling a little more than you can handle, eh? And you daft, my frogs are hungry. To feed them. Um, why don't you take me... Uh, let me take a few of your frogs off your hands at the moment. And let you swing prop the net properly. You're after me. Take it. Oh. Fairy dust. Okay, awesome. <laughs> well, it's hoppers and stick in the belly faster you catch. Er, here. I'm gonna feast tonight. How about you deal agree to train me for your pets? Okay. Mm 
frog slime acquired. The last thing is dog's hair. Okay, let's see if I can find the other... Yes, I. You give me a hand, would you? Yes, I would love to have a hatchet. I mean, what? I'll probably uh, go bother help clearing away some of the dead logs. Yeah. Okay. Take the hatchet. Oh, so that's where we get them from. Is this log? So then the only other thing... If I try that other one over here... messed it up. It's lower here. Hmm. I'm missing... I'm missing stuff. Okay. I think I need to make a pot. I have clay. I have plenty of clay to make a pot. But I need... Okay. Over here real quick. Mm, nothing here. Okay. What else do we have? Because we're missing one item currently in order to be able what's over here Fireflies, some dirt. Okay. Flower petal. Okay. to create one of these an empty jar awesome forest well okay let's go down to the forest well and try and find it it's right here here's hoping that we can find it Actually, 
now is the perfect time to end for this episode. I am going to leave that here for this episode. If you're not already, feel free to subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.